We're here with freshman face-off specialist Mitch Wilson after a uh, difficult Atlantic Sun opening loss to High Point University 9-8. Um, Mitch, it was, a, it was a tough first quarter, but uh, the team rallied. Yeah, I mean, we're a team that's never going to quit. Uh, we show a lot of heart and we have a lot of heart. That's something we really like to implement on our team. And I feel like we showed that today coming on the second half. Uh, you were much improved uh, with the wing play and the face-offs today. How much was that a factor in the late run? I mean, it's been a factor all year, and it really showed during the second half. I mean, I was kind of struggling in the first half, and they really picked me up and told me not to quit. And I didn't quit on them, they didn't quit on me, and we got the ball. Uh, one of the big uh, key factors in the fourth quarter during that second half rally was uh, you scored right after your classmate, uh, Dale Matisse. What, uh, you know, what kind of momentum did that give you guys on the sidelines? I mean, it gave us a lot. Uh, I wasn't really on the sidelines, so I didn't really know. But I feel like after that goal, we kind of knew, like, okay, we got this, boys. Let's just settle down. Let's let's, see together. let's keep our bearings here and let's get this W. But unfortunately, we didn't. But it still showed that we have the heart, we have the drive, and we have mental fortitude to win the games. What was uh, what was your thought going into that last faceoff after uh, Dale Matisse scored with 39 seconds left? Uh, really just trying to get the ball. Uh, my coach, Coach Grimm, came and talked to me right here. And he's uh, saying, you need to get the ball, we need to get this one. Um, I mean, it, it, was a, it was a big face-off, I knew that. So I just tried to calm down and just get the ball for us. And uh, you guys are on the road for another Atlantic Sun game next weekend down at Mercer. Um, a little bit of time off before that. Uh, what's it been like after this four-game stretch in a week? I mean, it's been exhausting, but uh, the coaches have been, have been giving us the right amount of exercise during practice, you could say. Uh, but we're, as I said, we're a team that won't quit. We're a team that's going to work hard. We're a team that's going to prepare right for this next game, like we have been all uh, doing for all these other games. So I feel like we're going to come in. We're going to, we're going to get a W versus Mercer. All right, and uh, good luck next weekend down in Macon. Thank you.